These are my Facebook story from September 2018. I was a different player back then. But now, I just get out from Arkham Bracket. It took me 4 months to finally reach Legend Medal. But I believe I can do this. I just need 1600 MMR to reach Define. Since I'm playing on Legend Bracket, there will be no more toxic Arkham player. And that's what I expected. At first, everything is going really smooth. On game 1, I play Necromage. Someone on enemy team shows his 9 win predict and they provocate me. I said, okay. And I lose to mid patch. But I managed to recover and go for Aghanim build. Long story short, I stomp them really hard. Kill them all! You're mine! start making excuse we win the game and i said sorry for mirana game two i wanna play seven patch but they won't let me i have no choice so i play marcy and i was unstoppable Weaver underestimated me and shows in front of me like this, so I give him a little lesson. And another monster kill. I got 11 kills with only one death. Look at the timer. 12 seconds later. I make Skyred mad and he abandoned the game. Max Stalker is also leaving. I win the game with no effort again. Legend Bracket is so easy. If I keep doing this, I can get to Define in no time. Game 3. I play Marcy again. I was doing good on my lane. Even my Dazzle is trash. He chaos me for no reason, but I'm okay with that. Help me out, please! And he don't even have one level grave to save me. It's okay, I managed to win my lane alone. Dazzle finally leave me alone and it was good for me until this toxic Fano come to my lane. He TP for no reason and he missed his spell. I said careful, they ready for us. But he keep going and die. I told you this is a bad idea. And he blamed me for that. I have to stay PMA, and I did my best. Five minutes later. On minute 20, Feno start blaming everyone. I'm Iran. And Dizzle keeps stealing kill from Kor. What is this shit? I just tp people for that kill, and now they taking fight on top without me. I said I can go there, but they keep throwing. Phenomancer always play alone, and he make Phantom Lancer reach. It's now 4-10, and he call me idiot. This game becomes so hard, I have to buy BKB, so I try to get BKB, and they say I farm the whole game. When I'm close to get BKB, they keep asking me to join fight, so I join them and I die. Oh, hell no. We lose the fight and they blame me. We also lost mid barracks. Do you think I give up already? Hell no. I still try my best. You're not going anywhere. Jeez, that's a big fish. And I finally get my BKB. That was a good kill for us, but my team being too greedy and they all died. Lucky for me, I got Mjolnir and BKB. I can handle Phantom Lancer. I'm 
Give me a break, would ya? Aha! Wait for it. Something bad happened. Dezel is really close to me, but he drave himself. And look what he said. That was so funny. But I don't give up there. I still defend till my last breath. But sadly, they already mega creeps. There's an Infeno die like an idiot, and I can do anything with only 3 people. And we lose. Game 4. I'm not touching Marcy anymore. So I look up on YouTube and find a random video about Dawnbreaker Echo Saber. What a good idea. I immediately pick her and go mid. To be honest, I'm not that good on this hero. And I perform really bad. Stop what you help me! Oh, I'm so stupid. Lucky for me, I get a good team with me. Play small, play small, play small. They really positive, so I give my best. Nice catch. Surprise, motherfucker. We took bottom barracks, and enemies start argue each other. I like this. This is cute. When this happened, the game became so easy. We finally win the game in 26 minutes. Game 5. I'm out of roll queue. And Dawnbreaker is banned. I have to play off lane so I pick Enigma. I'm winning my lane with Enigma and this game is so easy. He was dead already. No mercy. Every time this Kling shows up, I will kill him. Call your mother. <laughs> Look at the score, we surely gonna win this game. But we have one problem. There's a selfie slark on my team, and he never joined a class. I got him! Slark was there but he chose to farm instead of helping us. He chose to play alone and he always die alone. I already got BKB and we can win any fight together. But Slark always walk alone. And he make things fat. But the real problem start on the late game. I have everything ready but Slark still won't stick with us. So we secure Roshan and Slark took the ages. When we can get barracks, my black hole and BKB is ready but is not willing to play together. Oh no! Oh my god, I need help. And he waste ages and die. On our next fight, he finally join us. But he plays so aggressive instead of hitting barracks. And he stupidly died. Really? But we managed to win that fight. Yes, yes, yes. And we take bottom barracks. 12 seconds later. I'll throw now. <laughs> 
Yes, I'm gonna throw, bro. What's your fucking noob, man? It was brain damage. We ignore him in a secure ocean. But the same thing happened again. I'm gonna die! So fucking idiot! No matter what we say, he keeps throwing. He starts bragging about himself and being so racist. Go bro, show me some moves bro! Show me some moves bro! Come on bro, that's it, that's it! Yeah, fuck yeah. You're so fucking noob man, you're so fucking noob eh, you fuck you man. <laughs> poor country Arab, poor Arab man, poor Arab. We immediately push mid and force to buy back. <laughs> that was good for us, but we make a bad move. Back, 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 back! Yeah, you're so nice. You're so back, but it cost Gyrocopter life. After four of us died, Slot finally come. Fuck you! This easy game just become a hard game. They coming to end mid, but I'm already respawned. Just a little bit more till my black hole is ready. It's our chance to admit. Why always me? Can't touch me. Fan die again with no buyback. Yes! Yeah, bro, you see that, bro? You're so fucking idiot, bro. I'm so pro. And Slark being toxic till the end. We already 60% to Legend 2. Just 3 games away. Game 6. I play Dawnbreaker mid again. And I lose to Kiopi mid. Oh shit. He is very strong. But this time, I already know how to abuse this hero. Instead of going Echo Saber, I go straight for this later. I play like trash on this game, but once I get this later, everything gonna be fine. I'm coming buddy, I'm coming, I'm coming. Sorry. Very smart. Hero like this feels like a creep to me. Oh god, that hurts! Wanna try? Run away, dude. Just like what I told you. Next item I buy is Agarim Scepter. This is a good counter for heal like Faceless Void. Anyway, I have a bin dagger now. I can catch someone like this. Monster kill! Too easy. Call it a little girl. Ding! 
Ding dong, bitches! Brain damage. Just like that, we win the game. And I got MVP. Game 7. Groundbreaker got banned again. So I play Zeppelin Sky for a quick game. Yes, I'm serious. This is my secret build. I just buy 4 talisman and get rot of Aethos and kill everyone. There's actually a toxic anti-mage on my team, but I'm tired, so I ignore him. Long story short, we secure two set of barracks, and we win. One more game. Thank god Dawnbreaker is not banned, and I play like a herald. Fuck! But I believe on this hero. I try my best to get everything I need, and I give my best. Hey, stop right there! We take enemy bottom barracks and we also secure mid barracks. My team plays so good and we win. I'm officially a legend to player. This game is so easy.